How's everybody doing? Um, I told you I was going to post a video uh, update about the Contagiously Cool for Christ concert, the second one. Um, I'm sorry to say that it's not going to be held at Crossfire. Um, and this is due to, um, I guess, people calling into Crossfire saying that my lifestyle doesn't display that of someone who should be throwing a Christian concert. Um, I don't understand that and I'm sure most of you guys watching this don't understand it either. Um, never got a call from the board at Crossfire, which is who they called. I never got a call from them to inquire about these calls that they were getting. So I guess these people were somewhat important in their eyes, uh, money-wise or however. I am a dedicated soldier uh, for the Lord. And what I do is display what He has done in my life. Uh, I've been through literally hell, man. I, I have come from, I've come so far in my life and it's all due to him, you know. Um, the streets of Chicago, man, I was... <sighs> gangs, drugs, violence. I mean, the stuff you see on TV, I lived. And now, I'm living the life I live now, which is giving back and uh, inspirational speaking. My music, the music is all clean. You, you, you won't put in one of my songs and hear any uh, profan profanity. I am human, just like these people that made these calls about me. Um, and I sin, um, just like every human being sins. I don't think that that stops me or anybody else. I don't that think matter. that stops anyone from telling the world what God has done in your life. Uh, we all are a work in progress. So, and I will be a work in progress until I get to heaven. So for me to say I'm gonna wait until I'm perfect to display God's amazing miracles that he has performed in my life would be ludicrous, you know, um, be crazy. So, I don't know, you know, uh, this message is not to deter anybody from going to Crossfire because I, I feel like it's a good place and I feel like um, it's a wonderful place for kids to come together and be able to do something besides hang out in basements and drink and get high and, and things like that. I think it's a great place for that and I think uh, Josh and Brian and, and some of the other volunteers that work there are very, very, very good and you can learn a lot from them. They. They're very passionate about what they do. Um, they, they had nothing to do with my show getting canceled. Please don't take this as I, wanna, I don't want people to go to Crossfire type video because that's not it. Uh, I'm not one to cancel my shows and I feel like an explanation is owed to you guys, my fans, why this show will hopefully just be relocated. I'm not sure because see they just let me know yesterday and it's not very much time for me to put together another spot. You know, I put a lot of money into this show already, and I guess that's just gone now. I'm full of love, man, and I'm gonna continue spreading it. I'm not gonna stop, you know, and, and those that seem to want me to understand that, that's never gonna happen. I'm gonna continue spreading love. I'm here for a reason. I do what I do for a reason, and Everybody else does what they do for a reason, you know. Everybody has their own purpose. We all make up the body of Christ, you know, if we really want to get, you know, down to it. You know, everybody's something different. And everybody has a different purpose. Um, to attack mine instead of embrace it is baffling me. I don't understand it. But again, it's probably not for me to understand. And like I said, this is not a a hate message or a don't go to crossfire message. 
or hate everybody on the board at Crossfire. It's not. It's just me explaining to all of you why this show will be moved or possibly canceled. Plus, it's me explaining why I'm here and just letting you guys know what I go through doing what I do, you know. Um, There's so many, I get so many messages from people that, that tell me that they couldn't approach, I mean, not even in the state, you know, out of the state, everywhere, they couldn't approach the church where that's in their neighborhood or or they couldn't approach the people that they know that know about God because because of judgmental ways and because they didn't feel comfortable in telling them, you know, what was really going on in their life. So they they they, they uh, send me messages and I just pray that God to speak through me because again I'm not perfect by far and my opinion might not be the right one. So he speaks through me, and I, there's been so many people to come to the Lord. He's used me a lot, you know, and he continues using me. And again, I'm not gonna stop. I'm never gonna stop doing what I do. So that's that. Um, I look forward to maybe relocating this event I know it's last minute, everybody, but I really, again, I had no, I had no control over this. Just found out Friday. Um, it was kind of cut and dry. Like um, we're gonna have to cancel your show. Wasn't anything but that. So yeah, I just found out. So again, I'm, I'm working hard on figuring out another route to go. If I don't, then I'll just have to reschedule for another time, um, which is sad because I've got people coming from out of town and out of state to do this show, you know. <laughs> I'm baffled. I don't really understand this. Uh, but I do understand that Mario Street will continue making music. Mario Street will continue giving you what I've got. Mario Street will continue telling you what God has done in my life because God has done miracle, miracles, miracles in my life. My life is a oh, total change from what it was in the past and me displaying that is letting people know that went through what I went through or that's going through what I went through that they can do it it can't with God things can be different you know I, I don't have to be perfect to tell people that so I'm gonna continue to tell you guys that man I love each and every one of you and and I love God I love God unconditionally and he is not ashamed of me so I'm gonna continue moving and keep on going baby I love y'all and uh, I hope to see you at the show God bless Try to stand in my way. for a reason my purpose is going to be fulfilled i will never 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 bow down to anybody anything this is something that's going to happen and i love and i love and i love this life in christ